Anda Sissinger pa si pogledajte, kako je bilo. Za nami je drugi angliški večer na Ljubljanski valdorski šoli, ki smo ga zaokrožili z verkinim ženskim pevskim zborom iz Northumberlanda, moškim pevskim zborom Janeza Kersnika iz Lukovice ter mešanim zboru učiteljev valdorske šole. Kako se je začelo to medsebojno meddržavno sodelovanje zborov za vašim? Ja, pravzaprav smo imeli, imamo nekaj prijateljev v Angliji, potem smo to s tem prešli na takšno zborovsko oziroma glasbeno sodelovanje. To je postala že kar tradicija, tako da je zdaj že nekaj zborov preko našega prijatelja Davida Brbiča. Jih je prišlo v Slovenijo, v Ljubljano in na šolo, za kar smo sploh veseli, zdaj se srti tako, da je raven, da so bočitnice, ampak vseeno smo naredili angliški večer, kot pod navadi. Pa tudi mi smo bili, zdaj na coj bosta dva zbora, mislim, en moški zbor, ki smo bili spomljati Drugi zbor, zbor staršeni učitelji Valdorske šole, je bil pa lani pri njih in zato je to eno samo veselje. Kakšni so plani za prihodnje? O, planov. Torej, mi imamo sicer še dost različnih planov, ampak vendar le, kar se tiče Anglije, o, o, la, la, ne, mi jih moramo še doreč, ampak mi kar vzamemo en paket, tole zdaj le nekaj za organizirati, nekaj za narediti, vsi smo nadušeni tem, da so prišli in da bomo imeli tale večer, potem pa, potem bomo pa nasnuli na črte za naprej. closely, slightly represent English culture with music, with dancing. I think you've answered your own question. That's exactly what it's going to do. And I'm looking forward to seeing it. We're going to hear boys singing and girls singing, and we're going to have some dancing later. So all that's best about British culture, the sort of school age level. How do you choose choirs for mutual exchange? And what is your decision based on? Um, I, I choose choirs which I know are going to be friendly to uh, the people they meet here in Slovenia, but also many of our choirs in England now, I'm teaching them Slovenian songs like Teče mi teče, Nocoj po Nocoj, and this choir have learned Stralica as well. So uh, um, that's how I choose them. By, uh, I, I like choirs who have an open heart, and uh, like Slovenian choirs who I know will get on well with the singers here. Is this your first choir exchange with Slovenia? Uh, no, we've had uh, over 30 exchanges now, and uh, many of the people here tonight have been to uh, uh, on our exchanges. Uh, uh, Igor Velipic has come with the Lukovica Male Voice Choir, and also with uh, the Waldorf School uh, uh, Mothers and, and Teachers Choir to, to England. Um, but there's also um, there's some students I was just talking to there who, who came uh, uh, five years ago. They're students of uh, Moitza Belak uh, at the university here, and they came to England to our choirs festival. And there are 12 of them, and they sang in the, in the, in the choir festival there. So uh, it, it's very nice to be here. You know, Vreme Tukaj je slabo, je kot Anglia, ampak srca ljudi iz Slovenije so lepa in topla. Your choir sings a wide repertoire of world, folk, and popular music. So how do you choose your repertoire, and what is based on? Uh, I choose it, first of all, because it usually reflects the lives of women. It's a woman's choir, and we like to sing about things like children, uh, environmental issues, uh, peace, and so on. So I'm very much guided by our concerns, the things that we care about. Also, I'm very keen, to, we sing a lot of songs from our region, traditional folk songs, uh, and Northumberland is where we come from. So I like to choose songs that are very, because it's very distinctive music, I like to choose songs that come from there too. <laughs> 